we're gonna make a seared yellow fin burger. Yeah, sounds easy because it is easy. We're gonna make a little uh, sauce, a little dressing sorta to go on it. So I get a couple things. Mayo, capers, onion, and a little lemon juice. Start with a little mayo. All right. Oh, let me, excuse me for one second. If you use up all the mayo, put a new one in the fridge. Thank you. You can lead a horse to water, but you can't apparently get him to throw out the empty mayo. So we're making one, so we don't need very much, right? Just that. A little red onion right here. This goes in. Capers, but you don't, but you don't want the sauce. You just want the capers themselves, right? A little lemon juice. Uh oh, sorry, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh -oh. All right, hang on. Nobody move, wait. Use my lens cleaner, maybe. Okay. All right, here. I think I can fix this. Move <laughs> this. How's that? It's not so good. Oven goes to broil, and now we get a little pan, and on the heat we go. So this heats, that, let's get the bun out, so we're ready, sauce is ready, we're almost there. I'm going whole wheat. Okay, so a little oil in our pan, and then we're gonna grab another piece of the yellow fin, right? Like we used before, it used to be frozen, it's not now, I bought it at the supermarket. You can do that. And then I've just got some red leaf lettuce here that I gave a little rinse to that I want to leaf for this for. And now we get this ready and it goes in the pan. Okay, quick slice, a tiny bit of oil, tiny bit here, a little salt, a little fresh ground pepper, right? Both sides. Hello, hello, hello. I think it's ready to go in. This nice big piece of yellow thin. in. And now you can see it's already starting to cook and getting white. The key to this whole thing will be not having it get white all the way through. Let it go about a quarter of the way, cooking until it gets white up one side, flip it over, quarter of the way, white going the other side. And then you take it off, then you still have a little bit of pink in the middle. So you see that? That's ready to flip now. Oh. Oh. There, that's perfect. One of the problems people have is they cook this stuff way too much. Not enough heat, that's a pretty hot pan, and they cook it for way too long. Don't do that. It's almost ready, so we'll throw the bun in. You're gonna love this. I mean, I'm gonna love it. You're gonna love watching me love it. That's what I mean. So let's take lettuce, from the nice red leaf on here. We're gonna put some of the sauce on the top. Just like that, with all these capers on here, and now let's get the uh, yellow fin. Serrated offset knife. Perfect for this kind of occasion. A little more sauce right here. Oh, come on, baby. It fell over. Come on, look at you. How did you get so nice looking? Still rare in the middle. Great looking sauce on here. Here's looking at you, kid. Oh yeah. See, you know you can eat tuna fully raw at sushi, right? So don't look at this and go, oh my God, he's eating raw tuna. Because it's seared, it's pink, it's, it's perfection. I was maybe two minutes aside on that, maybe two and a half. That's all. Tuna day. Rules. It's messy, but it rules. I love this stuff. I'm gonna finish this. You guys, we'll make some tea. I'll see you later.
much. If you want uh, the recipes that we made on today's show, check the website, ctn.org. Okay, go ahead. You ready? Yeah. I've been raised since 10 o'clock this morning. <laughs> it's 37 minutes ago. Is it coffee enough? <laughs> yeah. Hello, welcome to today's show. I'm Sam the Cooking Guy. <laughs> Maybe you should face the camera. <laughs> oh, 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 back up there, Jack. Back up. Bam! <laughs> and then I was going to put it down. Okay. To say something. And now I'm ready to put the other things on it. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Can I actually see what's happening right here? It's cool. The stove's going to be a freaking mess to clean when it's done. <laughs> 